stronger than steel, cheaper than carbon fiber, capable of stopping a speeding bullet. It sounds like a futuristic material from outer space, but engineers say the revolutionary new substance is actually made of wood. An associate professor at the University of Maryland's School of Engineering says this new way to treat wood makes it 12 times stronger than natural wood and 10 times tougher. The team at Maryland tested its new creation by shooting bullet-like projectiles at it. The fully treated material was able to stop the bullet before it broke through. Take regular wood, add solvents, heat, and pressure, and you've got whoa, super wood made three times denser and ten times stronger, says Liang Bing Hu at the University of Maryland. Well, interesting replacing steel and the carbon fibers by strong uh, wood structures. So you can be, uh, they can be lightweight, uh, strong, and uh, low cost. Think about this kind of test. Hu is finding new ways to use wood. He and his colleague, Tung Li, have made wood batteries. They made transparent wood. Wood has been existing on Earth more than a million years, and a human being has been using wood for furniture constructions more than 10,000 years. And then the more we worked on this material, we realized we haven't never fully exhausted the potential of this amazing material. The key to superwood, who says, is partially removing a chemical called lignin. So the lignin is like a binder to hold all the components together in the natural wood. And in our process, we found out uh, to be able to densify the wood completely, uh, we have to remove some of these binders. By removing about half the lignin with chemicals and pressing the wood for a day or so, they say it's strong and light enough to build cars, airplanes, wind turbines, and more with it. There's still more work to do, but Lee and Hu say someday lumber mills may take the place of steel mills. Steve Baragona, VOA News.